Hey, good morning. Uh, could we be any more excited to be here? Uh, we're out here today in central London, Clapham Common, at Friends Fest. Now, this is put on by Comedy Central, and essentially what it is is set tours and photo opportunities and things like that. So hopefully we're going to get to see uh, Rachel and Monica's apartment, we're going to get to see uh, Chandler and Joey's apartment, and Ross's apartment. Uh, fingers crossed we'll be able to go into Central Park and have a coffee as well, and get some of those really iconic photo opportunities. Um, so tickets for this today are £34 per person, um, plus a £175 booking fee that was from Sea Tickets. Now this is going all over the course of the summer and it's travelling around the UK. So I'll put a link down in the description so you can uh, check that out and find tickets for that. Could be sold out, uh, procedure's going to be a little bit different over the course of this. Obviously we're, we're in a little bit more uncertain and difficult times. Um, but if you enjoy the video throughout, give us a thumbs up. Really appreciate it, it does help me out a lot. And uh, if you could hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to be notified when we post all new videos, that'd be fantastic. So let's go and have some fun and get some of those really memorable moments. So I'll show you guys a bit of the setup. We've obviously got Central Park here, automated photos. Yeah. Got the pivot staircase. We're just gonna go in and do the main set tours now. Ooh. We're at 10 2, so where do we go? Hey, you're right, you have the QR code on your phone for the photo. We've got our timeline of the whole Friends saga here. So starting in 1987, that's when everybody first meets, really. And then we're going all the way up to 2004 when the show finally ended. I say finally, I was sad when it ended. Watch the reunion special. Got some props from the show here as well. Monica's vows, Chandler's vows. Ooh, we got some driving license here. Phoebe's driving license. Chandler Bing's gym ID. Smelly cat, cat litter. The sock puppet. Got the list. She's not Rachel. Who on earth is Rachel? Phoebe Buffet. The vampire layer. So we're in uh, Chandler and Joey's apartment. See Hugsley the bear, Hugsley the penguin at the back. As Monica says, who's the foosball table. Uh, these devices are cameras and you scan a QR code, that'll take your picture in front of the foosball table, in front of the lazy boys, and then you'll get those delivered to you at the end of the day. Supposed to be sad. But do remember, they are props. So the uh, media cabinet that Joey locked himself so in after they got robbed. Gentle. Or as they got Watch robbed, sorry. Watch your step as you move around the apartment. And please don't open any doors, as they don't lead anywhere. Please ensure you are wearing a face covering. So you've got the uh, corridor between the two apartments as well. And we were just told that this whole setup is because of COVID. So normally you would have a free for all. We've got Rachel and Monica's apartment now. Again, we've got the photo opportunity. So we've got one in front of the picture frame, one on the table, and we've got one 
around the back on the sofa over there. I'll try and give you guys a better shot when we get around there. Can afford to live in such an apartment in New York with their mother's wages. Despite the fact Monica mentioned she inherited this one rent control from her grandmother. Still, you can imagine what an apartment this size in Greenwich Village would cost for someone on a waitress's way. For Joey, as a struggling actor. So we were just told uh, on the overhead speakers, the picture frame that's behind the TV, that was put there so they could, because uh, there's a hole in the wall, and they used that to put the camera through to film on the sofas. So that's pretty cool, interesting facts. And you obviously you see the setup that they've got with all of the bits and pieces on the shelves. Try and make it as good as possible. Proper old school CRT TV. Bit of an update on the experience here. They've just closed off the queue to Ross's apartment. Um, there's a chap that's telling people on the uh, on the sanctions that because they've closed off the queue, you're going to have to go back to the exit later, and they might let you go in to take pictures, which is pretty cool considering we all obviously paid the same price. Me and Becky are quite lucky because we got in on the last. Uh, we're the last people in the queue, um, so we're cool, we're quite happy with that, but it's just a bit of a poor experience overall, so just bear that in mind when you come to check it out. And that's the queue. So our next one is Ross's apartment. Again, I'm sorry, they've got the cameras right in the way. Face coverings can be removed only when using our photo Our photo spots here are the Unagi curtain hiding thing and then we can have one on Ross's sofa as well. This apartment is of course the setting where everyone found out about Monica and Chandler's secret relationship. You can see uh, Monica and Rachel's apartment through the window. All the dinosaur bones obviously. Give you guys an overview of the site. So we've got a little bar here. Uh, the the main marquee, obviously, in the right in the centre here, is the apartment. So you, that's where we just came from. Uh, you've got Chandler and Joey's. You've got Monica and Rachel's, and then you've got Ross's apartment. As I said before, the situation in there is a bit poor. Uh, they're kind of they're really rushing you through, actually. Uh, you've got Central Perk, where we'll be headed to very shortly. And then here you've got the photo booth where you get all, all your gifts. So you can do your pivot photo opportunity there, you can do the routine, uh, and you can recreate the titles. Uh, and could you be wearing any more clothes? First up we're going to recreate the titles. We'll then go and pivot on the staircase. Um, the clothes one looks really busy at the moment, so we might leave that for a little bit. So this is what you got, you got the sofa and all your umbrellas. Hmm. Hmm. Where should we go? Should we go to Central Park? Get a cup of coffee? Like proper New Yorkers, a cup of gel? I like the, I, I really like the photo boxes that they're using with all the little images on it. Again, this is a very similar experience, all your photo opportunities. This is actually a, a coffee bar and then you've got photo opportunities inside Central Park itself. So in order to order from Central Park or the food court for the Central, the Comedy Central Bar, that's what we showed you earlier, you scan a QR code up by the till and press. There you go. Coffee, hot drinks, muffins, snacks, soft drinks. So you're going to order a cup of coffee and then you've got all your, your list of everything that you've got. Reasonably priced, £4. Mm -hmm. Syrups as well, caramel syrup, vanilla syrup. And then I'm going to have, well this is all coffee, so I'm going to have a hot chocolate. So, mm. what's she like? Hot chocolate with flake and cream, obviously. Yeah. Middle one off. 
Cool, this is good. We're showing you how to delete items as well. And then we're going to get a muffin. Or a snack. What have we got? Blueberry crumble, fruit carrot cake, lemon meringue, salted caramel muffin. Uh, salted caramel muffin. And then let's see what's in the snacks so you guys can see that as well. Biscuits, crisps, and Kit Kats. Oh, sold out of everything. Hmm. Amazing. Cool. All right. Let's uh, let's check out then. And then this part, obviously, I can't show you. So here we've got Central Park. So have your picture taken in front of, like, on the couch. Again, this year photo booth. Phoebe's guitar stand over by the window. And you can get one uh, behind the register as well. The layout seems bigger than it did in the show. Maybe I'm just wrong. And then obviously the little hidden Easter egg is that reserved sign. It's always there. Alright, let's give you some overview of the food. So this is the vegan. Joey's Pizza. It's Joey's specialty with two pizzas. Veggies, barbecue chicken, pepperoni, just cheese. 12 quid. dogs and we got donuts and smoothies and everything there as well they haven't got any prices on the hot dogs so I can't let you guys know how much that is but again it's all done via the QR code and then we've got the one with cheesecake oh they have got cheesecake here and ice cream a vegan cone, which is quite good. New York cheesecake, eight pound per slice. It's really expensive. Uh, who am I kidding? Pay per view porn. So the one on the screen here is where uh, Chandler likes shark porn. I love, all the, I love all the signs. I love, love, love all the signs. We've got another photo up right by the entrance, that's uh, Phoebe's New York cab. So this is the one that hasn't got any uh, seat belts, breaks down all the time, they get stuck right in the middle of nowhere. Got some more photo up so you can have your picture on the Central Park couch again, even though you can have that done in Central Park. Uh, but you've got the Friends Fest logos behind you as well there. Uh, you can have one in front of, or well, inside the door, where you put, all put your heads through, and uh, you'll have your heads poking through the edge of the door, and you get one in front of the, uh, the picture frame as well. They were saying that this, uh, this picture frame uh, actually broke early on in production, and then became a pretty iconic piece. There's really big cues for everything. Uh, this one's not too bad. We're gonna go and find a smelly cat in Central Park. The sets are really cool. I just think it's a little bit rushed. So you got Central Park. And then back at the, we got the cafe. All right, so we've been in uh, Central Park now. So I'll pit uh, a couple of our pictures in now and you'll see what that's like. Next up, we're gonna go to the pivot photo opportunity. It's getting busier here now. So I don't know how this is gonna be. Hey, what, you brought Joey? Well, I brought the next best thing. So we've got the, uh, the, the couch. 
couch gag scene now. So you can one up, one behind, and then obviously you get your picture taken. Uh, so I'll put our picture in now. So the way the could I be wearing any more clothes one works, uh, you've got a green screen. Uh, the fellow here, he's got a tablet, you scan your QR code and then it will take a picture of you and then show you at the end. So I'll put my picture in now. Our next photo spot is going to be the routine and we've got the Monica's turkey head dance opportunity as well. Uh, we're probably not going to do the routine this particular uh, photo spot we've queued for probably about 30 minutes for it though. I just want to do the, the turkey head one to be honest. It does give you instructions on how to do the routine and if you want to follow along at home there you go 12 easy steps ordered food we got ourselves a joey special two pizzas uh, so we got two pepperoni pizzas again we ordered via the qr code and, uh, and we also got mama rose's cheesecake <laughs> and uh ross and rachel have been getting cheeky in the museum seating's not great here there's not a lot of places to sit but um we just come and sat in front of the stage it's so our final photo spot for the day uh, is pin our head through the door uh, so this is where they're not allowed in for dinner they all manage to open the door and put their head through but the chains the chains across so they all look through and I'll put our picture in of that now our final area is the shop Let's see what we've got in here That's quite a cool little bag. 15 pound. Got some socks with all of the cast's name on it. So we've also got baby chick and baby duck t-shirts as well as hoodies. Got some magnets and key rings and a weekly planner. All right, so we've also got the Lego Friends set. Central Perks, this is £65, which is quite expensive, but it's Lego, so. So we've got tea towel as well. We've got bum bags or fanny packs. Trivial Pursuit. So we've also got uh, some top trumps, some puzzles. And we've got a Monopoly set, which is really cool. 
So you got dinosaur, pizza, hat, guitar, bag, uh, shirt. And then we turn it around and it's basically uh, like iconic episodes. So we start, brown is the very first episode and blue is the very last episode. It's really cool actually, it's 25 pound. And then the final thing we've got is Hugsy. And he's 30 pound, which isn't too bad. So that's pretty much everything in here really. Well that's it for our time at Friends Fest here at Clapham Common in London. As I said uh, at the intro of the video, this is going all across the summer, various locations all across the UK, so there will be a link down in the description so you can see uh, where you can go, what your closest one will be. Um, being completely honest, I've been here, I've been before, I went to one a few years back at Blenheim Palace, so it's a slightly different experience now. In my opinion, it felt very rushed. We we still had a pretty good time, and we enjoyed ourselves throughout, because uh, obviously we got to see the sets, we got to take pictures and things like that, but you didn't get time to absorb it. You, you didn't get time to really soak in where you were, and if this is your favorite show, you're gonna be a bit frustrated that you've paid 35 pound, basically to come and not really get that opportunity to, to sit there and have a look at that prop on uh, Monica and Rachel's table, not be able to see the, the coffee pot, not stand at the sink and uh, stare out the window, things like that. So that's a little bit frustrating, but still you're engrossed in the experience and everybody here is a fan of Friends. So you're all kind of hyped about that. Uh, you've got little clippets of the show going on all around the site which is really good and they had some pretty good food items as well. The whole uh, the, the procedures and the way they did the food ordering on the QR code was a really good idea. That made things really useful and you didn't have to stand around too much. Uh, they were encouraging at the moment. Remember we're in different times um, we're still having to wear masks inside here in the UK and they were pretty much encouraging you to take your masks off for the pictures which is fair enough because you want some good pictures but then people they weren't telling you to put your masks on after so if you're a little bit uh, uncomfortable in those situations then you know something to bear in mind but uh, I would say come and check it out but not this year come next year if it's uh, if it's back but obviously we can't guarantee it will be back next year they like the money so it probably will though um, so if you've enjoyed the video if you've enjoyed seeing the sets and enjoyed seeing us taking goofy photos uh, hit the thumbs up it really does help me out a lot I do appreciate it and hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to be notified when we post all new videos we'll see you on the other side thanks